Hey everybody, my name is Ivica, thank you so much for joining me on my latest Roblox Studio beginner tutorial that will show you how you can get plugins, especially if you're using the new UI, the new user interface, but if you're using the old one, the same principles apply. So right now on your home screen, basically of Roblox Studio, you have several tabs up here, including plugins. However, these plugins will only include the plugins that are preset and the ones that you added so far. Interestingly, if you right click on this, you don't have the ability to add plugins, even though that would be logical. Instead, there are basically two options to go about the same process. First of all, you have up here plugins and you have the option to manage plugins. Now, again, these are the, the ones that you have already get gotten in your kind of UI or your Roblox game. But the thing that you're looking for in plugin management is this blue plus sign up here. Once you click on it, you'll get the toolbox and you'll get the plugins drop down menu here and you'll have the ability to either search them or find the ones that you're looking for directly. However, you can do the same if you go to your home tab, open up the toolbox directly and then it will probably be on models or something like that. Ch simply change it to plugins again and here you will be able to, once you click on it, add it or save it for later date you can even kind of rank it and go back find something else and so forth pretty easy pretty simple but in terms of ui i know that many of you are super unhappy with the new ui the old ui is functioning in the same manner you'll just have your plugin somewhere around here and once you open it up again you'll be able to see the ones that you have installed you'll be able to manage them either to plugins like i said here or through the toolbox that you have again in your viewport as an additional window where you can further open up, see, check out and install the plugins that you want to use. There it is, pretty simple, pretty straightforward. The new UI kind of made it more complicated, but not that complicated. Hopefully you found this tutorial useful. If you did, please consider checking out several means how you can support me. You can check out my books on Amazon, including my best -selling book that can help you overcome procrastination. You can check out my patron page you can check out my channel memberships and maybe become a channel member but of course the cheapest easiest fastest way to support me just subscribe to this channel and be here for my new tutorials that's all for me my name is Ivica thanks for watching have a great day have loads of fun in your Roblox Studio adventures and I'll see you on my next tutorial until then goodbye